Autumn weather on the Saunders farm was a little girl farm with was very cool few memories of a big the brother who protected me. Golden waves like the ocean. More often, I Young felt Millie, I had to protect myself daughter, from him, Mrs. and sometimes Saunders, I would find myself protecting my mother the from him too. A pretty lilac dress. This particular the white fight with her father had escalated waist, more quickly than most, however. A shouting match became a tornado of fists in what seemed like a matter of seconds, banging through the room, knocking things over, and leaving havoc in its wake. In that moment, the rage between my father and brother was so forceful that no one person could have stopped it. No one would have dared. Toward the forgotten bar. By the time I was the a toddler, was I had developed Metal the instincts to sense when violence was coming. As, as though I was smelling group. rain, I could tell when adult screaming had reached a certain pitch and, and velocity that not meant I should take cover. By the exterior, when my brother was around, inside. it was not her uncommon for back, holes to be punched in walls or for other objects to go flying. I never really knew how or why the fights would begin, but I did know wonder. when tension was turning into an argument and when an walls, argument like was destined to become a physical fight, and, heavenly and I knew so this particular one was going to be epic. Into the pile of hay on my the Nana Reese was there, which was a bit odd because it was rare that she or anyone from my father's family who lived in Holland was at our house. We were in Melville, a predominantly white, affluent adjacent town in Suffolk County on Long Island, New York, so I would eventually move 13 times growing up. Skin. Thirteen times to pack up and go, to try to find another dreams, place, a better place, a safer place. Besides, Thirteen new stops, thirteen new streets, with new houses full of people place. to judge Millie, you and wonder where or who your father is. Later, Thirteen occasions to be labeled cool unworthy and, and discarded, to be placed on the outside. Pastor Nana Reese, the good Reverend Roscoe Reese, and their African Methodist Pentecostal Church, were where my father call. Roy was the last, only son of no Addie, Nana Reese's sister. Her skin broke out My father spoke, never lived with his father, and there was always a potent distance between them, a mystery that inevitably held her arms, in misery. So now These people, living the in the village of Harlem, were his the people. They had come up from Alabama and parts of North Carolina and other regions of the South, bringing with them traditions, traumas, and gifts, some of which were ancient, African, and mystical in origin. Nana Reese and I found each other right before all hell really broke loose. The thunder of profanity, fists, and feet drowned out all other sounds, so I didn't hear when the cops burst in. The warmth of the family I didn't know if they had come to save us or kill us. It was Long Island in the 1970s, and, and two black males were being violent. Their the appearance the of the police almost never meant that help had arrived. On the contrary, their presence often complicated and elevated the existing terror and escalated violence. That hasn't changed, but this was my first encounter with the fact.